Oh, hey there, fish brothers and sisters. It's uh, Jonathan for Tailhunter Sport Fishing down here in La Paz. And uh, we're having a really great morning. Just sort of wanted to give you a midweek update on what's going on. I'm, uh, our day starts about 3 or 4 o'clock in the morning. 5.15, we put out the boats for Las Arenas. Uh, 6.30, we send everybody out who's fishing here in La Paz. 8 o'clock this morning, we send out our divers and snorkelers. And uh, just a few minutes ago, got some of our, uh, our good friends out back to the airport so they can head back to California with a, a nice load of fish. But wanted to tell you, you know, last week, if you've been listening to our or watched my uh, Mexican Minute, uh, fishing was a little slow, a little spotty last week. Really had to work hard for our fish. Well, this week, at least for the first couple days, looks like things have turned around. Not spectacular by any uh, stretch of the imagination, but certainly compared to last week, it's gotten a lot better. The Dorado have come back. Everybody's getting four, five, six, seven, or, or more Dorado limits, I should say. Not a lot of big fish, but that fun size, you know, the schoolie uh, size, five to about 15 pounds is what most of the fish are. Uh, some 20 pounders in there, some bigger fish lost, a lot of smaller fish being let go, and uh, just everybody having fun. It was uh, it's certainly a lot better than it was last week when it was tough to even get one Dorado. Also, good news, we got a couple of Wahoo this week. Funny thing is, you know, it's been one of those years, we've only gotten a couple of Wahoo all year. Well, uh, the Wahoo that were caught this week were caught by guys who weren't really trying to catch Wahoo. They were trolling for other things, and the, the big skinnies came up and bit them. And uh, also, well, no tuna yet, but the rooster fish showed up again this week. You know, it's been a couple weeks since we've seen any roosters. We had some folks specifically target roosters, and this is not the time of year when we get rooster fish. Normally they're gone by now, but got some 30, 40, 50, I think one was even close to 60 pounds, all fish released, so everybody's happy. Uh, it's been a good week on an, another, uh, uh, on the other side as well because the Malacon is open. I'm driving on the Malacon right now. The waterfront has been open for a week after being closed for about five months. The churches are open, stores are open, bars have been closed for about five months as well. Those are now open. It's been a lot of fun to see people on the beaches. The beaches as well have been closed for the last five months. So folks are in the water. It's just nice to see people out. I never thought I'd say I, I like seeing traffic, but it's nice to see folks out, cars cruising the, the Malacon at night. Our Fubar Cochina Cantina, we normally close at 8 o'clock at night. We've, been, we've had to stay open until 11 or 12 o'clock because there have been just so many folks coming out. But like I say, it's just good to see families, good to see people skateboarding again and rollerblading and, and all that other stuff, walking their uh, dogs and having the families out. Anyway, just wanted to give you a quick midweek update to tell you things are looking really nice here. We've got a lot of you coming down this week, so if you're coming down, temperatures are a little cooler than normal. Instead of in the hundreds, it's a very comfortable, you know, temperatures in the lower 90 degrees. Water temperature still about 80, 85. So looking forward to having you down. Thanks for checking in. Hope you're doing well. Take care of each other. And this is Jonathan from La Paz, Baja, Mexico, and the Tailhunter Sport Fishing Fleet. You take care. God bless.